Zach and I met, we would hear from friends in relationships or marriages, how they knew their partner was the one. Things like, they're my best friend, or everything was telling me yes, and it seemed unreal. A relationship that love was balanced and felt equal just seemed fictional. That thought went out the window the day that I met you. Everything we heard over and over again was real, and it was genuine and tangible. Shelby, you are one of the most amazing people that I've ever met. You are kind, loving, patient, funny, hardworking, dedicated, very forgiving, and absolutely gorgeous. Thank you for bringing a beauty and joy to my life that I didn't know was possible. Thank you for being there for me when life has brought its challenges and lending me the strength that I couldn't muster. And thank you for giving me Maddox. Zach and Shelby have brought us here today for an occasion of great joy and cause for great celebration. Having found each other, they, will, they have built the kind of relationship that will serve them well as a foundation for their marriage. They've chosen each one of you to be here with them to witness their wedding vows as they join together as husband and wife. Marriage is a bold step into an unknown future. In marriage, two lives are intimately shared and the blending of the two must not diminish either one. With this ring, I give you my promise. With this ring, I give you my promise. To always love you. Cherish you. Honor you and comfort you. I promise that I will love you. And keep my heart open to you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. And by the power vested in me by the state of Utah, I now pronounce you husband and wife.
you are the love of my life. I've never believed in soulmates or true love, but if it's real, we have found it. You are someone who is deeply devoted to loving, caring, passionate, and supportive to any loved one and to our small family. You are constantly trying your hardest to be the best man you can be, even if you don't see it, I do. You inspire me, Zach.